Hi everyone, this is Divya Srivastav from DYPCOE Akurdi Pune. Today we'll be discussing the objectives, design, working and the cost analysis of my project which is the doctor's robot. Starting off with a brief introduction, so why do we actually need this robot? As we all know, doctors and the medical staff play a vital role in getting us out of this pandemic situation. They are the most vulnerable to the deadly virus and hence they require assistance to minimize the physical interaction. Moving on to the objectives of this robot, the robot primarily aims to minimize physical interaction between the infected people and the medical staff or the doctors. To minimize this physical interaction at isolation wards and at ICUs, the robot will help doctors by collecting or gathering medical data which has to be monitored regularly. As seen, the design will include depth cameras to navigate the robot. Different actuators, sensors and memory elements will be controlled through a processor. The body of the robot will be divided into different compartments which can store medicinal pills or food items which can be del delivered to the patient's room. The wheels as shown are only wheels which improve the movement capability of the robot. Working of the robot. The robot can navigate using cameras. It can be programmed through the interface by nurses such that the robot can deliver medicinal pills or food items directly to, to a patient's room. Simultaneously, it can also collect data or medical test records which have to be monitored continuously by the doctor. These records or this data can be uploaded to the doctor's mobile phone or his or her desktop. Coming to the cost analysis, the figures shown are an approximate and may vary according to the components used. In future, this robot can be used to collect samples from different patients or remote areas where a doctor cannot be physically present. This robot can also perform or conduct physical examination, which includes recording body temperatures and blood pressure. Thank you.